Hello guys, Guy Christian Adio of Let's Play Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. In the last episode, we rescued Tannis! I thought he was a strange wife. <laughs> uh, fun stuff. Anyways, in this episode, as you can see, I am out in the middle of the desert, and there is some stuff to be done here. Like I said in the last video, this is a very open area, and there's not much to it. However, I want to go ahead and show this off real quick. You can see there are a few things that dot the landscape, and I'm trying to see if this will trigger it. Yep, it did. Okay, cool. But basically, when you uh, hit certain areas of this map, basically you're going to get ambushed by sand people. So we get our first uh, taste of what these guys are like. I'm going to kill you first, because you're a beat. Oh god, they hurt. They actually do hurt. They attack twice. Or rather, they hit twice. So do I! Haha, <laughs> jerk. Alright, cure. I'll do it. Alright, refuse pile. So that wasn't really worth it. But, uh, let's see. Uh, there are little markers that pretty much prevent you from, uh... Oh yeah, we should loot these guys. Uh, because if you loot them, you get Bantha Fodder and you get, uh, Sand People clothing. That's important. Let's see, it says... Uh, they'll pass yourself off at least from a distance and may make entering the same people enclave a little easier. All the non-droid members of your party would have to be wearing the robes for the disguise to work. Since you don't have robes big enough to fit the Zolbar, his presence would certainly give you away. So that tells you two things. Well, three things, really. One, you don't have to disguise the droids, so T3M4 and HK47 are completely fine. Two, you can't bring Zolbar with you, because the outfits won't work on him. And three... Whatever non-Jord characters you have, they have to have disguises. So even though we have a disguise right now, we still need a second one. And, uh, let's see, there's some stuff over there. Is there anything else? Hmm. I guess. I guess we can do this. But yeah, we're uh, obviously we're gonna have to find one more uniform to get mission. Or me disguised. Basically, that's basically what it means. So it's a very, that's a, a very helpful thing. Anyways, who are we... you? Ah, it doesn't matter. Can you handle a blaster? It may attack again at any second. I doubt we could hold out on our own against another wave of them. Uh, I assume this is sand people. You would be right. Came out of nowhere. Wait, damn it! Here they come again. How did they do that? Alright, so we basically got to fight off a couple of sand waves. Uh, sand waves. <laughs> sand people waves. Oh god, there's a few of them. At least they're picking them off pretty quickly. Oh, and HK got hurt a bit. Alright, I'll let them come here. Ah, uh, that's the only one I can target. Alright, let's go. Alright, keep him off. Yeah, <laughs> improved floor. Oh, that, that's done. Hey. So I guess maybe that's what. Damn, we're actually getting hurt kind of a bit. They were targeting mission there a bit. I think I'm still in good shape, though. Well, still in good shape. No, you're dead. Okay, come on, guys. Let's, let's kill them, please. Can't die now. This is actually hurting a lot. <laughs> Damn, it just it really stacks up after a while. Okay, there we go. And right, the cure doesn't heal you. Uh is there no remains? Really? I'm surprised. Alright, well now we can talk to you again. Thanks for your help. I don't think we'll try holding this position for much longer. We're not soldiers. Mm. Did the company send you? It's about time they drove these animals out. I agreed to try and stop the attacks, at least. Well, you've got a lot of work ahead of you. Do you know about their enclave in the south? Don't even try to go near it. They've taken all the Zerka weapons that were supposed to protect our sand crawlers. That place is a fortress, a death trap. You'll have to find some way to sneak into that place. Glad it's not my job. 
Uh, do you know anything about them? Just that they attack everything on sight. Well, I suppose they don't attack each other, but any outsider is as good as dead. The company tried to arm us and even set up remote self-powered turrets on the mining route, but, but that just made things worse. We're not soldiers. They still kill us and then take our weapons off our corpses. They even had the Jawas disable the turrets and set them around their enclave. It's like a fortress now. I don't know how you're going to break through. Yeah, so they use whatever they, they have turrets too. <laughs> so that does make this kind of the gun blazing thing a little bit more difficult. That goes for blasters. It's not like you need to be a genius to operate them. They probably don't even bother with special settings. All right. I don't have time for this sort. Of yeah, right. so do we. Get going. There's no way we're appearing this thing while getting attacked over and over. The desert can have it. Ah, the Jappos will salvage it eventually anyway. Then we can buy it back and start over. <laughs> Makes sense to me. Alright, and well, I guess they're good from here. And luckily that cutscene filled up my force points a bit. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it actually has some parts. Alright. Man, none of those guys dropped the remain though. That's kind of annoying. Anyways, over here, we can find some actual creatures, not sand people creatures, but, um, let's see, what do I want to, yeah, oh, damn, alright, another ambush, oh, it comes right from where they are, damn, uh, this might rock one of them to come over, it's this elite warrior is going down pretty quickly, and I guess not mine. Oh damn it, they started attacking. Alright, well I kinda wanted to show this off anyways. Uh the desert rage. Like these are creatures. Oh god, they hurt. Okay, I'm probably gonna die. Uh, I'm not gonna survive another one. This would you guys shoot these things already? Not a force. And I'm dead. Great. Can we at least kill this one? Alright, well we killed one. How come Blaster Fire isn't doing anything to these guys? Oh my god. Wow, that didn't do anything either. Okay, I don't remember these guys being so difficult. Alright, you know what? Run away. <laughs> it's time to run away. Abandoned thread. I don't remember these guys being so resistant to blasters. Oh, and you missed. And you got hurt. Get a kit. Keep me going. Yeah, see, like, I'm barely doing anything. This is insane. I don't remember these things being so tough. Maybe it's because I always had a Jedi with me. Alright, see that big stuff. Come on, just keep doing that and we'll be good. As long as I keep repairing too. I will outlast. Yeah, see, now you're doing damage. Okay, I might be able to outlast this thing. There we go. I guess those things are just resistant to blaster fire. Hmm. I guess. Alright, so there's a pro tip there. If you're gonna hunt these things, go out with Jedi. Or at least some with swords. I'm always having to waste my repair kits. Nah. What? But anyways, after that crippling failure, there is a good reason for wanting to kill the um, uh, the raid things, though. First off, let me get this guy's disguise. Because it's actually really good. Uh, the problem with... Uh, well, actually... Let's see, let's... Give you a sword. Because I need two Ready. melee people. What? All right, and I'm gonna have to probably wait for my health to go back up. But uh, anyways, if you search the remains of the of the desert raids, you'll get skull plates, and you can actually take those back to Faso's place and sell them for a profit. So assuming you don't get your ass kicked like I did, then basically you can um, get a bit of a profit off these things. I can't remember if they respawn. I imagine if you leave the planet and then come back to it, then the desert raids will respawn. 
Um, anyways, uh, I'm gonna pause for a bit so I can let my force and stuff come back, so I'll see you in a bit. Uh, you know what? Actually, this might take a little while. I'm like, I kinda wanna get going. Mm. Alright, you know what? Let's go ahead and use a, uh, med kit. Alright, let's use another one. There we go. I can probably live without force powers, so let's just get going. Alright, but uh, anyways, we want to actually head towards the south a bit. We want to clear up this area so that, you know, we can um, actually... Like, there's that over there. I can deal with that later, though. Because, like, you can see some bikes there, but they're basically... That leads to another section of Tatooine. And there's a few guys there, and this is where we want to go. So, I right, take on these sand people. But yeah, this enclave. This is where the um, enclave. Is. One down. I think the other one. Right? Okay, we've already killed three. So this is going well. Oh man, he's done. Right, come on, I can finish this guy off. He's not too many. Wow, Vision's after getting her ass kicked. What's going on? Come on, Vision. Yeah, Vision's getting her butt kicked. What's going on? Oh god, there's more of them! What? How? How? Alright, well that's one. Oh god, I'm too weak. Alright, what just happened? And there's another one! Where the hell are these guys coming from? Okay, if I stay around, I'm dead. Because they are attacking way too Alright, at least I killed him. What the hell though? There were only five of them. Where did those other four come from? Ah, uh, they're still chasing me. Not the damage. Okay, good. I can take them off, I guess. Except they're, they're resistant to my glass of fire, too. What the hell's going on here? Well, then again, I realize I don't have the best glass rifle. I mean, it only does 1 to 8 damage, but it shouldn't be doing this badly. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, are you kidding me?! So my character somehow respawned. And now I triggered an ambush. What the hell? Shit. Uh, HK's dead. At least I'm alive, though. What the hell just happened? Seriously. The yeah, no one else is alive. Alright, uh... Okay, seriously. I, I have no idea what went wrong right there. So this is... Oh, I'm not gonna be able to get there. Ah, uh, I'm trying to get them to disengage. Uh, if I get to the anchor hit gate, maybe they'll go away. But seriously, how the hell did it... Uh, it was going so well, too, and then the game was just like, Hey, I'm just gonna spawn, like, a ton of these guys for you. Have fun. And there's still one chasing me. Heal. Thank you. Oh, God, there's two. Ugh. They're all still chasing me. I can't return to you. Well, I'm dead. At least I can get a advanced thing off. Alright. Alright, that's one. See, I can do a lot, but... I guess this is the disadvantage of going in with two blaster pieces. Seriously, I don't remember these guys being so resistant to blaster fire. Even with the weapons that I have. Oh, I'm sure someone in the comments will say, Hey, you're still be using these kind of weapons. But, eh. Oh, great. It heals. I'm wasting so many of them at that. Alright, you can die now, please. There. Finally dead. 
see. Although I worry because all my friends are all the way back there. Let's see. Guys? Are you coming? Well, I probably shouldn't. Be Damn. I'm not responding. I'm hmm? Only I'm alive. What the hell's going on here? Man, I can't go back. That's right, I had to have the whole party with me. I guess there must be an enemy or something hovering over the both of them. Otherwise, they would have um, picked back up by now. Because they only revive when there's no enemy presence. Let's see. You know, all I can really do is just head back. See who's, like, stalling me. Yeah, let's go ahead and waste one of these. Gets me up to pretty much full strength. Alright, uh... Alright, well, there are these guys here. Oh, there's... There's a whole train of them. <laughs> Goody. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they're just kind of standing there. Still, I'm the only one alive. Well, let's go back here. There's obviously a guy still here, otherwise mission would have picked up by now. Yeah, there's one guy. Okay, I could take him on. I'm almost at full strength again anyways. <laughs> Assuming the game doesn't spawn another three. <laughs> wow, I'm hacking this guy. Uh, if only more people could be Jedi, and only if only I had more powerful rifles. Are you gonna get up? Let's see, we can at least take these guys' stuff. Get some gaffy sticks. I don't know if you're able to skip these guys if you have sand people clothing on. I just didn't want to take that chance. I wonder why. Yeah, why isn't this getting up? All the enemies are gone from here. Let me loot the rest of these guys, I guess. At least get their sand... Um, like, I don't really need all these sand clothing, but the gaffy sticks you can take because you do get money for that. And I don't I don't believe they give you evil points for that because I think they, the game expects you to kill a few sand people. I don't know, I guess I have to kill the, um, the sand people around HK, which doesn't really make much sense, but okay. Oh, no, it's just a person. Alright, so I guess I... Well, at least I'm at full strength now. I should be able to take on them on as long as I only, like, proc one at a time. But I guess I have to kill these guys. Okay, good. It looks like only one attack... Oh, one attacking at a time. Well, for now. Anyway. Now, if I could stop missing... There we go. Now we're talking. Hey, don't stop that. That's my that's my trick. Ah, damn it! They're doing a lot of damage. Don't remember them being this powerful. There we go. All right, let me cure up a bit. Alright, that should be enough health to last. Can he throw another grenade? Is this the guy that threw that ice grenade thing? Alright, that's him down. Oh, okay, this guy's almost dead, so... You killed my droid. Prepare to die. Alright then, hopefully people respawn at this point. Okay. HK's up. I assume they're good. Alright, I'm gonna end the video off here, because obviously I need to do some prep work and stuff. I don't know. The next episode, hopefully I don't die as much. I'll see you then, guys.